Welcome back. While museums and historic homes in Knoxville have their doors closed, Emily DeVoe shows us how they're still letting visitors inside in a way they never have before. Take a tour inside one of Knoxville's most historic homes. This is one of my favorite pieces in the collection. Without leaving yours. Hi everyone. Patrick Hollis. Welcome to episode three. Is the executive director of Mabry Hazen House. So although I have all this cool stuff. And he like came up said, with a series of videos he calls live from the parlor. Parlor actually comes from the root word parlay to speak in French. And so we, we want to think of a way to kind of talk with people through each room. And so we go through uh, the formal parlor, the dining parlor. Um, we're now making our way upstairs into the bedrooms. The videos offer the house's virtual also, visitors obscure details about the lives of the families who called Mabry room. Hill home. Exactly. We get up and we open the books and you can see the inscriptions and get real close with the objects. And so it was a really neat way to uh, give people a different view of Mabry Hazen House, yet continuing to provide a educational and fun way to Get out of the house. Mabry Hazen House isn't the only historical home in town trying to think of creative ways to educate the public without technically being open. My name is Mr. Michael and I'll be taking you on your field trip today. The we Blunt Mansion a uploaded a virtual a field trip. There's a secret compartment in the back. In the McClung Museum of Natural History and Culture is showing off its displays with the hashtag Museum From Home. This is young Evelyn Hazen. Even with so many new virtual ways to experience Knoxville's history, there are still costs to consider. Without field trips or fundraising events, museums and homes like Mabry Hazen House are hoping the public might be willing to donate like they would for an in-person tour. If this house wants to continue on for another 160 years, it's going to really take some support from our community to be able to, uh, to provide all the necessary expenses that come along with a historic house. In the meantime, stay safe and stay healthy. For Live at 5 at 4, I'm Emily DeVoe. By the way, the next Live from the Parlor episode is Thursday at 2 in the afternoon. You can find it on the Mabry Hazen House Facebook page.